Darkness beat my ass, so she's on the run right now. Let's see what can go down in this next set of Boardwalk 102, our third Tekken bracket for Boardwalk Smash. All right, starting out with the power crush, and here we go. Starting the offense for Reyna. You got to pick up off the ground. That wasn't that wasn't guaranteed. Looking like Cher is in right now, but missing the guaranteed uh, four four three, I believe. Oh, uh, no big, punish though. Yeah, big block, but no punish out of that. Over the whiffs, and we're Pops. getting some interesting interactions right now. That's what Bonte does well, is that he uses the movement out of the largest stances to get good uh, range and good with punishes, uh, mostly from his 2-1 uh, back. Once he gets that offense going, it's hard to stop, I will say. Yeah, and that's, I mean, both of these characters are very similar in that, that manner, that they both, once they start going, once they take their turn, it's very hard to get them out of their turn. And there we go, we're getting another counter head launch going right now. That's what we like to call Casino Tekken. I think these two characters really embody. Yeah, and casino. now we got hit all the way down to Tekken 6, going back to a second 6 stage. Got so hit so hard using Tekken 6. All right, looking pretty even so far. Oh, hot, hot kick. kick, hot kick to start the round. Pretty risky, but it works out in uh, Darkness's favor. A drop combo right there. Good job, interrupt. Um, yeah, so that's one thing you can use to interrupt uh, Lars's uh, stances. A lot of his stances you can just jab or do a quick uh, mid check to get him out of it. Um, but you need to be careful if he does 2 1, he can do his little Beyblade move like that to get out of the range and catch him ashing. And here we are, we're seeing Lars and Heat. Lars and Heat is very scary uh, with his uh, 3 plus 4, the plus uh, charge and to lows is pretty scary to play against. But once you can figure that out, you can really exploit large while using heat. Using down for one to keep some pressure going. And ooh, missed counter hits from both sides. And we have a counter hit launch on Lars's down back four. We're gonna get a full combo after that and we're going downstairs. Is he gonna pop heat? Yes, we're gonna be seeing heat going. And we're gonna keep that into great Oki for that. What a uh, low parry. Yeah, great low parry going right there. Oh, and great, great wake Reyna. up right there. Oh, oh and he pressed. He pressed. He cannot do that against Reyna. That's going to catch you every single time, as Sheridan has showed us. To, and he has demolished us with that many of the times. And down for it to end that round. Pretty even, even right now. Final round for this first game of the first set. Between these two. There we go. See, this is where he he thrives in this 2-1 into movement to really confuse his opponent to get in. And there we go. We're seeing some great side steps right there. Real good movement right now. And great tracking. Really confused his opponent right there. I didn't even know what was going on. That was a great, great round by Bonte. We're right. heading to Sanctum. Sanctum, two wall breaks here. And downstairs, we can get some more wall breaks. And both of these characters can thrive in that environment. Uh, especially Reyna, with a lot of her Heaven's Gate uh, mids. They can really break that wall. Round one. Fight. Oh, that's minus 14. You gotta, you gotta punish that, my boy. Oh, caught, caught pressing, but could not get conversion, a conversion right there. Oh, uh, trying to go for Orbital right there. Uh, usually that hits and it can crush the mids and the highs, but timing was there was a little off. He huh? got caught and was roughly in there. There we go, and this Lars and Heat, so he's gonna keep that right away. Oh, good float right there. Couldn't do much with it though, but still a good opportunity to take his turn back. Not punishing those kicks. And, the four, down four at four from Reyna. Uh, he can have real good opportunities for damage. He can launch with Lars. He has a 14 frame launcher. Four back to one. And he can take real full advantage of those, of those punishes. Right there, he could have used it right there. Unfortunately, uh, still doing some great offense from it. Um, using his, his opportunity to take his turn back. And it's working in his favor. Really getting the mix up going. And it looks yeah, that's going to be the end of that round. Match point for Lars right here. And still not punishing that 
he could really get some good uh, good combos off of that with his fortune frame. Uh, you need to stay down on the ground for that Oki. Uh, Reyna loves doing that. All, both of the Reynas we have at Boardwalk love doing that setup. Uh, get in the guaranteed unblockable off of Oki. What a great heat engager right there. Taking back his turn and being large and heat, he can really confuse his opponent and really take advantage of that. No break on the 1 plus 2, and it's going to be breaking the wall. And that's probably going to kill, but has heat. There we are. Oh, we got Chairs in Backseat Gaming. Chairs in. Couldn't come and win in real life, so now he needs to vicariously live through another Reyna player to get the win. Oh. Special style electrics. Very interesting. I haven't seen that before. It's very similar to uh, like modern controller players in uh, Street Fighter. Wow. I've never seen anyone do this before. This is a new tech. Uh, that's Tekken 8 for you, buddy. Tekken 8. We got the Forbidden Tech coming out at the boardwalk, but I mean... Looks like it's working. Looking like we're about to be survival point for darkness and set point for Bonte. Uh, got caught mashing again. That's unfortunate. Really can't be just throwing things out against Reyna like that. Good counter hit launch on that down back four. In full damage off of that. Den three and a good. Jab in her yeah, there we go. Oh, uh, doesn't block the second unsafe hit. Uh, using heat to try to get in, but it's unfortunate. And heat smash, raw heat smash going in there. And while running three, that's going to end the set. What a great game from both players. Really using both their offenses to engage the opponent, confuse the opponent.